Yo, 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 what's good, what's good, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, what's up with y'all, man, listen, man, appreciate y'all for joining me, man, if you could, please, man, do me a favor, hit the like button, please hit the like button for me, man, don't make me beg, please don't make me beg, hit the like button, share my video, man, comment, let me know what you think about uh, some of these um, players and things that we got going on, man, um, you know, hey, we got a lot of stuff, a lot of good news, great news. Um, what's going on at Florida State, man? Definitely excited about the uh, the way that this transfer portal class is turning out, man. This transfer portal class is turning out to be an A plus class, man. We get us a big D tackle, it's over with. Trust me, it's over with. We get us a big D tackle, it's over with, man. So listen, man. With no with no further ado, here we go, man. Listen, first off. We just got this commit, like, and I know y'all probably done heard this already. Not sure if you have or haven't, but at the end of the day, uh, Sean Murphy, man, this dude from Alabama, bro, 6'2", 225, man. I'm talking about monster. Looked at his film, straight monster, man. This dude ghosting people, bro. When I mean ghosting people, he, give, he, he, he making people give up the ghost, man. I'm talking about this dude is straight balling. So, listen, when I tell you, he got three years of eligibility left, eligibility left, and he is definitely um, a dog, man. Like, I, man, I can't believe, you know, he's only a, a redshirt sophomore this year, so I, uh, I guess, well, redshirt freshman. So what I'm guessing is, you know, Alabama just got a lot of talent, man. Alabama just got a ton of talent. So, you know, they can't really, um, you know, he couldn't really get on the field like that. But listen. The upside is great. So what I'm thinking is he come in this year, this dude definitely going to be a super, a starter, bro. The way this man go out and make tackles, track the ball, it's unheard of. I'm talking about heath seeking missile, man. He come in there lighting things up. He ain't waiting on nothing. You know what I'm saying? He ain't scared of nothing. Fill gaps, and he's super fast. Exactly what we needed. So he definitely, man, going to be in that thing doing what he need to do. Um, I feel like next year, like this coming up season, he'll be in there. Probably him and um, Blake Nicholson will be probably sharing time this year. And then I'm thinking next year, him and Blake will be the one starting, bro. That's going to be a heck of a linebacking core. So that dude right there, man, um, Sean Murphy, Sean Murphy is a straight monster. So excited about this guy, man, from Alabama. Another one of them Alabama commits. Um, Bro, yeah, he all that and then some. And in other news, man, look, we just got a commitment from a dude named JB on Hilson. He's 6'3", 225. Now that dude right there is a is a straight up dog as well. Um, we got his commitment in, and he's with the 2025 class. So right now, that put us right now composite. We number eleven, Florida State right now. And I know it's early because 2025. We're gonna get a gang of kids that decommit, that gang of kids that decommit from other schools and come to us. So that really don't hold no value. But just right now, we looking good, man. We ranked number 11th overall in this recruiting uh, deal right now for the 2025 class. Now, this dude, J.B. on Hilson, bro, he good. Pretty good rush in. Um, I'm going to say, you know, he not, you know, I, I look, he a good, he's a good player. He's definitely somebody... Got a great motor, somebody that you would love to have on the team. He just gave us his commitment. That's big. That's huge, man, because we need edge guys. You know what I'm saying? And we've been struggling recruiting at the high school level at those positions. So that's pretty big, man, to get this commitment from this guy this early for the 2025 uh, you know, class uh, cycle. So that's good. Remember that name, J.B. on Hilson. Now, his next guy I'm about to talk about. Look, say your prayers, man, to wherever this guy goes. When I tell you, straight up monster. He ain't gave us no commitment. And he more than likely, he loves Georgia, man. He say them coaches call him every single day. But this dude, Zayden Walker, is the number one linebacker in the country for the 2025 class. Mr. Mike Norvell just took a visit down there to see that guy on Tuesday, man. So that's good. Mike showing them, hey, I'm out here. We on the road. We trying to come see y'all like right now. He just went down there and checked this dude out on Tuesday, man. I'm telling you, 
if this dude chooses Florida State, which he done been on a visit, he came on a visit this year, this dude is an absolute dog. I'm talking about probably one of the best I've ever seen, man. Like 6'3", 230 as a freshman, true fre as, a, as a freshman in high school, dude play tailback and linebacker. And when I tell you super fast, gets out the blocks, get out the gate. You can't tackle this dude. Just big. I'm talking about just naturally big. Just a naturally big kid, man. Just freakish, freakish, freakish athletic talent. I'm talking about he on the same line as, um, dang, what's the dude name from the Gators, man, uh, who played D, D in um, The Freak. Y'all remember The Freak. Javon Curse. He is just like Javon Curse, man. He's just, I'm talking about fast. This dude definitely running a 4 4 40. When I tell you, light things up, super strong. And that was filmed from his freshman year. The dude to be a senior next year, man, he could reclassify now. I promise you, he would be the number one. He would be the number one linebacker, even if he reclassified right now. That dude right there is an absolute monster, man. Zayden Walker, y'all remember his name, man? Listen, whatever battles he ain't got to do, whatever the coaches got to do, whatever you want me to go do, we need to get this guy on our sideline, man. He is a game changer. I'm talking about game changer, straight up game changer. So I like that dude, man. I, I hope we can get him, man. Like, like I say, Norvell, he's a real good kid, too. I'm talking about... You know, I know I had said the character sometimes, you know, can can humble your talent. But, nah, this dude is a good kid, man. Great character. Um, and, wow, man, I'm talking about just a beast of a player without even trying to be. Just a monstrous player, man. Zayden Walker. Y'all go look him up, man. Do your homework. Do your homework on him. Do your homework on Zayden Walker, man. Do your homework on Zayden Walker. That dude is a monster. So that's all I got for y'all today, man. Like I said, it's ex it's exciting news. We got us a linebacker who actually has years left. You know what I'm saying? Not just a one and done. So we got us one, man, that I know we can get on the field this year. He he probably will be the best linebacker we got. That's no joke. So Sean Murphy will be the best linebacker we got. He get a, get a spring in, get in the fall. I expect him to be starting right away. That's right away. His film... The film don't lie. There's nobody on our team that can play like this dude right here. I don't care. I don't even care about who on there who's been there for five years. They ain't better than this dude, Sean Murphy. So he need to be on that field. It's good we got JV on Hilson in. It's gonna say 6'3, 225, 2025, commit. And um, you know, we went down there and talked and talked to Zayden Walker, man. And man, we just need we need that, Norvell. Get that done, man. So anyway, y'all. Hey, that's all I got for y'all, man. And as always, go nose, go nose.